My name is Brad Loring. I'm the focal on the Fort Nelson fire. Oh, the hazards we're seeing here um, directly related to the drought that we've had in the past few years. Very clay loamy soil type that we're having with the very minimal root rooting depth. Trembling aspen, birch, uh, and spruce have been greatly affected here uh, along with all the other juvenile species that are amongst it. Uh, thick stand forest like we have in behind us here is uh, once you create a face or a uh, fire vent comes through and it opens itself to the wind, you end up having the trees not being able to move consistently together and eventually you have failures. The roots have burnt, we have a green top so we've got lots of weight up top in the canopy and they're failing in every which direction which is indicative of terrible soil, terrible soils and insufficient rooting systems. Now when we do when we do get rain does that add further complexity because it makes the ground even less stable? It, in, it, indeed it does because now we've got that top three to four inches of of soil that if it's been affected by fire it turns it's just mud. Finding that they'll fail on any given time and unfortunately with very little or or sometimes even no wind. 